We're in Seaside Heights with Jenny and Nicole, and it, this just honestly feels kind of like a religious experience. I feel at home. How yeah. does it feel yeah. for you whenever you guys come back to Seaside Heights? Weird. Very weird. Freaking extremely weird. It's it's so weird that we moved so close to it. Mm -hmm. So it's like we never yeah. left. But we try to avoid it because I get, I don't know, very nostalgic. Oh, yeah. I kind of miss it when I come Emotional. Home. I have a shore house that's like 25 minutes away, so. And you have a shore store Just right on the boardwalk. Oh, yeah, it's right over there. Yeah. yeah. The Snooky Shot, shot guy. Yeah. yeah. And I love yeah. like almost every store when you walk in, you see on the entire boardwalk a little bit of Jersey Shore in every window. Oh. Like, Our faces are everywhere. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm like, can we get a check for that? No. <laughs> you Royalties? Guys are, you guys are like the, the patron saints oh. of, the, of Seaside Heights. It's kind of amazing. Well, yeah. I love their hated. Probably hated most, Probably hated but it. it's fine. <laughs> There's just so many memories. Like coming here, it would be packed with people. Me and Dina dancing on the bar. You like watching to make sure we're not falling. The actual beach that you were looking for. Yeah, it's right there. Right there. Mm -hmm. Now we know where it is. Yeah, yeah she knows. Finally. <laughs> Being a Jimbo, do you guys have yeah. a favorite Jimbo's moment or just a moment on this boardwalk that you're like, oh, that made me, I would go back to there. I'd do a time machine back. Was Jimbo's the place that I took you after you got punched the next morning? Mm -hmm. Yes. No, Beachcomber. Are you sure? I think it was in the corner of Beachcomber. Okay. Wow, and like, so you went back back to, to Beachcomber the to, next day. to unpack Why? it? Okay. Oh, That's why I thought we went to Jimbo. I woke so. up and I was like, I felt oh. like a victim. You were a victim. Well, you I just felt like I got beat Fair. up. Yeah. And yeah. I like felt not okay. So I was just like, okay, it's the summertime. Jenny, will you just go and like get like a margarita with me? And usually she would do GTL. Like no. she wouldn't she wouldn't go to the boardwalk that early with me, but she got a drink with me and I was just like, oh. She because one of, down, these. one of these. Aww. Yeah, because half my um my cheek was swollen. Yeah. I look like a chipmunk. Well, the great thing about those, you know, explosive moments on, on Jersey Shore, or some, some of the most like traumatic, tragic moments on Jersey Shore, it kind of like created space for you guys to bond even closer, really become that tight family unit mm -hmm. that you guys that are was like. a big one for us. Yeah. Fifteen years later, it's amazing. Fifteen years. Oh, we're old. <laughs> <laughs> She's almost 40. Oh, oh, okay, shout out. Shout almost out 40. But she looks amazing. I was yeah, gonna say. 40 and fat. Yeah, yeah right? Thank incredible. you. Incredible. And watching you two, like, bond, even from, like, one of the first or second episodes, I think it's when you're doing cartwheels, and you're like, I'm so proud of that girl. My favorite <laughs> moment is that confessional yeah. as, they're, as they're playing <laughs> so you, cool. doing back walkovers, you know, the blurred, where things need to be blurred, and you're like, yeah. I, would, <laughs> yeah. I had underwear on though, but maybe yeah. it slipped out, I don't know. <laughs> and Jenny's just There's like, booty I'm so cheek. proud. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I, was, I was cheerleading at Karma. Do you remember the moment that you two sort of went from roommates to like sisters? Is there is there a, sort of like a, a moment in your mind that sticks out? I would say the punch. Yeah, the punch. Yeah. And it, I gravitated her the most though. Like out of all the it, girls, because she was like a badass and I loved her energy. Uh, so I was like, I like her. I just yeah. needed you know? to protect her that night. And it came like, it was instinctual, where I like hit the guy back. Oh, it was so good. Like, grabbing her and bringing her to the bathroom and that's when I was like I really do love this girl and we yeah so that moment I'm on. I'm so glad I got punched. <laughs> I, I, I no, love really, that you like, have this mindset yeah. all these years later that, that's I amazing. Mean, at the time it was like terrifying Awful. but yeah. we didn't even know it was back. gonna air remember they cut it from mm -hmm. the episode mm -hmm. they blacked it out so originally like they weren't even gonna show it because it was such like a controversial subject of the yeah. time. But then they asked me if it was okay to be shown. And I was like, it's fine, like it happened, whatever. Yeah, and when then, they asked you what was going through your mind, what, what sort of pushed you to give them the okay to, to Well, I want it. everyone to see what actually went down. Mm -hmm. And then also, like, I feel everyone wanted to tune into the show because of that. They were like, oh my God, mm -hmm. this little girl got punched in the bar. Oh, we kind of want to see no it. For no reason. <laughs> yeah, for no reason. So. And I loved how MTV respected, like, whatever decision you were going to go with. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. And that's what's crazy you said about like tuning in. You guys kind of like created viral moments before that was even like a I term. Think. Yeah. I feel, and now um, mm. we were just talking to someone who was like, I'm 19, but I love your show. I'm finding it out on TikTok. And like, it's like having oh, resurgences. Yeah. How are you feeling about like new, like young people, like discovering the show that aired like over a decade ago? It, it, it humbles you. 
makes, <laughs> makes me feel old. Yes. They're like, oh it my god, I'm 16. I just saw a, a clip of the show on TikTok. They're they were like, like I was, I'm just starting the show, and I'm like, oh. I remember 16. my mom watching, but I was too young to know what it was. Oh yeah. Now what gets me is uh, my dad's a big fan. Can I take a picture? Yes. And she's like 18, and I'm like, is he? Oh, that one's got to hurt. When you guys like, see the the moments pop up on TikTok, which ones are fun to relive, and which ones are the ones that you just like keep scrolling? Beating up the beat is always fun when we mm. see everyone yes. at the club. I love watching us dance like we used to. That's good. Um, uh, I know. I love the Where's the Beach. It's, Where's it's the Beach? Like wasted. Funniest. And one that's been popping up a lot for me lately. Your viral is, guys. He's my friend. <laughs> oh no, my God! Real. Yes. <laughs> when, like, when you bring Robbie back to the house and he's like vomiting, oh, and then yeah. you're like, No, guys. he was really my friend. He was from my town. Oh, he. Oh, he oh, was. Yeah, I, I actually I knew thought, him. I thought you had met him. Th Three hours prior, oh, no, and he, he I honestly cold. thought it was very. Sweet. That's why I was like, I need a friend. Like, oh, yeah. he was my real she friend. She was like ride or die, <laughs> right off the jump. <laughs> yeah. oh I felt God. bad. No, she. Yeah, and then the one that's like viral, your your voice when you're oh. when you like didn't show up to work or whatever. Like, yeah. why is everyone mad? Oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Like, why are you guys being? Like, yeah. Okay? Why are you being weird? Why are you being weird? Why no, is seriously. Yeah, yeah. Why is everyone being weird towards me? Yeah. yeah. Have you uh, seen a favorite use of that sound? Um. Oh my God, there's so many. Oh yeah. Like, I like the animal ones. Like a dog just on the carpet, and they're just showing the dog like. Yeah. No, yeah. That, that Stop. is so good. Like, yeah. What is your relationship with just watching the show back in general? Do you ever pop on the old episodes for a trip down memory lane, or you're like, I, no. I remember it quite vividly. Uh -huh. The best is when we're on airplanes, oh. and we see other people watching, oh. and, I'm like, and I'm just like, oh. It would be incredible if like they're watching, and then they like look over, and they're like, is yeah. that, is that Jake? Because that's like, happened before. And I'm like, cheers. Oh. <laughs> oh. With my champagne. Oh my god, that is, that is amazing. Okay, so this new season of Family Vacation. We gotta get into it. There is so much excitement because finally all the OGs are back on one season, including... Reunited. Does yeah. it feel so good? <laughs> I mean, it Sammy, no, it does. Ronnie, it does. Angelina, like everyone's involved. Yeah. This is the first time we're getting Sammy, Dean, and Angelina At the same on time. camera. I mean, yeah. this is just so monumental. How are you guys feeling? You'll see it play out, but I have to say I'm so happy Sam's back. Oh, same. Like, really happy. I feel happy. like we've been begging for a while. Yeah. Yeah. And then we got the feeling like she was just like, no, guys, stop. Yeah. So we like respected her. Yeah. And then we would get annoyed with Then she comes walking in and we're like, what is yeah. happening? Yeah, I'm like, I just thought about you like two weeks ago on yeah. a podcast. Yeah. <laughs> so a lot went down, but um, in the end, I think we're all very, very happy well, she's back. Also, because it's been a few years of family vacation, almost to the point where I was like, if she would have come back, you would have assumed it would have been like two or three, like the second or third season when she's like, okay, like they're actually like, I get their vibe and I want to see them again. But it is almost like, six years later and like she just appears yeah. were you like almost in disbelief and you're like sammy's actually here like yeah jaw hit the floor mm -hmm. like i thought it was an ai <laughs> Not i mean even it could like, be yeah, <laughs> yeah she looked like she was in a time capsule because she looked like she didn't age either oh no she didn't age at all it was we, a decade she was amazing. we just Looked saw incredible. her in person and so yes i, I, I thought it was 2009. Yeah. yes yeah. incredible so i was like this can't be real like, yeah. and she yells around the corner, and we're like, wait, what? Like, what is happening? And then when she just comes around the corner, like, I think my heart went in my butt. Yeah. <laughs> we all cried. I feel like we all cried. Probably. Because I, I think it's something that you guys have said for so many years. You, you, you really did want her to come back. How would you sort of describe the relationship you had with her over the past, like, I guess it's like six, six years since the, or five years since the reboot? premiere because I think that a lot of fans are sort of confused or, or curious about the communication because mm. at one point you guys wrote so hard for her but now it's like she's blocking and unfollowing and mm. this and that and there's tension. So well, you gotta watch. Yeah. <laughs> but before yeah. family vacation I would say we were very close. We had a show called oh, Moms yeah. with Attitude. Besties. She went on multiple times. You know, she stayed in touch during weddings and babies, and she, we were very yeah, close. Yeah, she met uh, Lorenzo, Giovanna. Aww. Yeah, so she, she was the family. first one that showed up for yeah. Milani's, you know, at the hospital. So it just, it came to like, um, I think the wires got crossed when the show got picked up and she just wasn't ready to come back. And she told us, she's like, guys, I made the decision, I'm not going to come back. And I think... I think it just like naturally just went our separate ways mm -hmm. and she was very adamant about not coming back and I think we took that 
positively and negatively because yeah. it's like, what do we do? What's wrong with us? Yeah. Like, are we not good enough for you? Mm. And in the same breath, we missed her but respected her. And then, yeah, I don't know. I want to know what, like, why she came back because I'm all here for it. Well, do you feels, know? I mean, she she kind of explained to us that the stars finally aligned. And yeah. my assumption, I don't know how you guys feel, but I feel like. Ronnie taking a break and working on his mental health, stepping away from the show, mm -hmm. just being in, in a new place in his mm -hmm. life, maybe made her feel safer to come back. I mean, then definitely play, play that a was huge definitely part, part yeah. of it. Yeah, and then I think it just got to a place where she thought it was too late to come back. Mm. You know, like I, also, it's, I also think she was healed too, with like everything that went down. But yeah. she needed to heal and move on yeah. from all. You know that happened on the show with Ron. Yeah. But now she's in a um, an amazing relationship with a boyfriend. You're gonna handsome be man. Uh, he is. So cute. Is he here? Beauty. No, I wish. I, um, yeah. We, we didn't. I wouldn't be him. talking. I'd, yeah. be ta I'd be just talking him. No, no. <laughs> Instead of where's the beach, such, it's where's the Justin. Yeah. 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 But he's such a nice guy. You could tell like they're in love and they have a great relationship. So I think just everything, like you said, aligned and she was she was ready. And that's what it was yeah. a beautiful when we were talking to her. It almost and I was saying it's like she really looks back on all of the ups and downs with such like a wise reflection where she's like, it, it almost feels like she like let go yeah. of things that might have been holding her back. You can she, see the closure. Yeah. And, and like, she's just, yeah, she's in a good space. It's yeah. impressive happy. for you two that you guys like were able just to kind of like, really like when the reboot was happening, you're like, we're ready for it. But did you guys have those moments of having mm -hmm. to like, self-reflect and look in her before jumping back into it like did you guys even have hesitations back then or were you just ready no because what they said was it was going to be a reunion <laughs> a one and done yeah we went and then in we're just we're you we're, just, we're still here we're here hundreds of episodes later, later. Yeah. Yeah. so we we'll went in like one. all right this is our chance it's going to be 30 days we're in miami we'll go home midway see our kids but like this is it so we went in like kind of excited because we did this yeah. e news like uh, with like five or six of us that Sam was a part of, of like getting together, like yeah, a little Yeah, it was kind reunion. of like a where are they now? So yeah, it was I like an episode. That. Yeah. yeah, that was so fun. And it after that, we got picked up, and I was like, oh, I kind of like miss us, and yeah. I kind of miss filming and doing Aww. all that. So, so we're like, so, it. Let's yeah, go. we had a great time. How is filming different now that we have all these kids hanging around? Hundred percent different. I, they, they, different. I love it when they pop up day on camera. Night. Yeah. So I feel like back in the day, we would just live in a house and be there for like three, four weeks and, you know, whatever, party, enjoy ourselves, whatever. I, I can't be away from my kids for like two, more than two days. So it's like if we're going somewhere my kids can't come, you got me for two days. You yeah. know, it's not like we can just like up and leave for four weeks. So filming is definitely way different now. Yeah. They call it more of like the housewife style where they're very family oriented. We take our kids. We go on our mini vacations together. But like yeah, we have like our OG three. trips, which is just like not not the kids. Yeah. And we'll go there for like two days. Yeah. So we like rage for two days and then come back home. And I love too though that we get to because you were like uh, I need my kids with him. We get to see so much more yeah. of you guys too in ways that like in the original we weren't able because just you guys having fun. But now you're like yeah. I have these kids. I have this family. I have all these other things going on. No, you actually see like our day to day yeah. life. It's a nice balance. Yeah. That's yeah. So nice. And I wanted to show that like just because I'm damn near 40 we have children life I'm doesn't not. end there yes. and like you yeah. can have that balance of having fun with your friends and then being a parent and going to work and like yeah, showing it's all up about balance yeah mm -hmm. right sometimes you're nicole sometimes you're jen i mean yeah you gotta balance it out no it's neither nicole snooki or jen there's Ooh. three. Oh, okay there's okay three. there's three there's a big difference so nicole's like the mom like still funny likes to have fun but like responsible organized laundry like get shit done right. boss lady and then Snooki is like, all right, I'll have another shot. Like, fun, dancing okay. around, bopping around. And then there's Dren, who's like, Fuck or not. The Antichrist. I'm going to kill you. I just got chill. Yeah. I just got... Like, you look at me and I'm like this. <laughs> Jenny's like, I'm going to stay away from her tonight. Her eyes separate. No. I'm an alien. And when her eyes separate, run. Don't look her. Don't look her in the face. No, yeah. Look down. Don't she, acknowledge she's her. She's great. Are there any signs that a J-Wow could come out or? Mm, she, she has an alter ego. Okay, yes. That's, cause... What's your name? Prickly Elder. Oh, Prickly Elder. Yes, Prickly Elder, does. yes. She, she does she's emerge. Fun. She's she does fun. emerge. She's fun. She dances. She stays up late. She does shots. Prickly mm. Elder is a good time. Very rare occasion, but she's fun. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <And> she's <laughs> I do. I love that his name is so good. I really like it. And Prickly I love Elder. that, like, I mean, you kind of have, like, 
Georgia Shore has inspired like so many shows, and I love that you guys hosted reunions for like Laura Bama Shore. You did Buck Shore mm -hmm. too. How do you feel like watching? You're like, oh my god, these are kind of like sort of like our kids in a weird way. Do you way. feel like proud moms? Like, I love Laura yeah. Bama Shore. Yeah, Those I love them. I know. They're all so sweet. So sweet. Buckhead Shore, they mm. were great. We did. We went to um, the UK and met Jordy Shore. Oh, amazing. I yeah. went to They're Alcohol. wild. Yeah, wild. Daniel Shaxon's abound. They're all like, like made wild. us look like nuns. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, for real. We, crazy. Paulie and I went to Alcapoco to announce Alcapoco Shore. Like, mm -hmm. there's a ton of them. I feel like we're the godparents yeah, of I've all these. All these babies. Shores. Oh my god. Yes. yes. I am curious though, when there was the idea of Jersey Shore 2.0, you guys sort of banded together and, ma and made a statement. Tell me about your feelings surrounding that potential show and, and why you decided to release that statement. Oh my god, I forgot about that. Yeah, there was a lot of um, behind the scenes stuff that we were like. Yeah. Annoyed about. Um, and also, I think it just came from a place of being blindsided. Very blindsided. Lied to about it. Um, yeah. And then also for me, it's just like we have all these shores. Do like a Staten Island shore or, yeah. you know, like something not yeah. us. 2.0. 2.0, by now. the way, means better. Oh. I don't know so, if they knew that. Oh, oh, well, speaking that's, of, kind of, that's kind of what it's insinuating. Speaking of 2.0, uh, yeah, Vinny 2.0 oh. for Angelina. That's another yeah. 2.0 that's 2.0ing. What, yeah. where are, are things at between you guys and Angelina and the, the Vinny of it all, especially you and Jay Wall? I feel so terrible for you and how, how that all played out. Oh, how she was shocked? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Genuinely shocked. But like, that very happy. Wild. Yeah. That edit was wild. <laughs> oh, okay, so the edit was wild. That edit, edit was wild. wild. Did, did, w w was Angelina in the editing bay? She, she was like, <laughs> I feel like she, she, was. she was. I feel watching the editing, I was like, okay, I'm like, wait, what is going on here? Mm -hmm. oh, because I have no problem telling it. Mm -hmm. Like, all my inner cuts that you see of me, I'm looking at Dina because there's this big picture after she gets engaged. If you look at a wide shot on the camera on the show, there's this big picture. So I couldn't even see Angelina through the picture. Oh. So all the facial expressions were literally to Dina across. The edit played her out. Played mm. me yeah. out. And I will, mm. okay? Yeah. <laughs> Sally Ann. Okay, okay, Sally Ann. <laughs> yeah. She's but Sally welcome Scott's to playing reality. Mm. Welcome to reality. Yeah. Yeah. You could tell that you were so confused when like, Mike sat you down, because you're just like, I don't even know no, what I'm being. Because yeah. like, I feel like you're someone, you're like, okay, yeah. I'll own and it. They you're didn't like, even, I don't even know what to own. No, <laughs> yeah. and then they didn't even show most of the club. That club, we had so much fun at Polly's gig. Oh. So I had no idea yeah. that they were out back mm -hmm. arguing. Like, zero clue. Yeah. And all I, all I remember that night was, for like 45 minutes, we were all sitting in the van trying to leave, and Angelina wouldn't come in. Oh, she, she refused to come in the van. And I I'm like, know girl, her, come on. And I didn't even know it was about me, so I'm thinking she's just still partying. I'm like, leave the bitch. Like, let's go. <laughs> yeah. Leave her. Right, well, I'm shocked they didn't use that. Yeah, you're the I'm surprised like, they didn't. <laughs> so I was yeah. like, leave her. And But like, I had no idea she wouldn't come in the van because it was me, and she was oh. cursing at production. I had wow. no clue. Cause I was There's crying. a lot that you don't see. And then we I see it and we're like, yeah. that's not yeah. how it went I was down. so happy for her. I was shocked, I was surprised, because we just met him the day before, yeah. and it was Vinny's birthday. So there was oh, yeah. like a lot to take Vinny's in. Birthday. I was gonna say, I, if I was at the table, I would be making faces just because oh, I'm Vinny like. Oh, Vinny was so annoyed. Yeah. 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 The one time he finally gets a birthday. I know. It's like, like oh, right. my turn. I know. Yeah, yeah. I will so. say that you guys, spoke so glowingly of any 2.0 before the engagement so clearly yeah, he's you guys, nice guy. you guys yeah. were a fan huh? yeah yeah and, if, and why yeah. wouldn't you be happy that angelina scored a great guy that's literally it yeah <laughs> whatever yeah. that happened i was like damn yeah how welcome are, to my career <laughs> <laughs> how are things with angelina today because we see in the teaser for the new season that eventually it yeah. seems like you guys and angelina and, and dina and, and sammy have a lot of fun together mm -hmm. Yes. But, yeah. So you remember how that played out, right? Yes. And you saw me very like, I was crying to Mike. I was very apologetic to yeah. her. Very apologetic. Like, probably spent three hours in that room with the girls, and Mike's apologizing to her, saying if that's what you insinuate or thought or whatever, I would never. So we left New Orleans thinking, all right, it's done. We're gonna move on. We started picking back up in our for the Orlando shoot, the one that's coming out, and she still has like problem with it and she brings it to Sam's attention so I'm like blindsided again that like 
again, she's texting me, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year's, we're talking oh. all during that. All during that. Dramers. And then, <laughs> Deleters. Yes. Come on now. And then it, she likes the drama. camera picks up and then she's like, I don't know how she's scorching the earth with my name to Sam. Do you feel like her, the tension with Angelina and the rest of the girls created space for her to want to reach out to Sam? She was like, I need, I need a friend. Yeah. Oh. I bet you that's how that's gonna play it's, out. Yeah. 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 Uh, it's I have like Toy Story. You got I reckon ten thousand dollars. <laughs> that's how it's gonna play out for no. sure. No. But there was no problems leaving you New know. Orleans. I just felt like it's always something. Why is this a thing? You know, it would never be a thing. Well, that's you what know, I'm happy for you. So I was so confused more than anything. I was very like, just like taken, like the legs got knocked out from under me. Confused. Cut to. Three or four months later, it's happening still. And I was just like, now I'm even more confused. Because I was thought we ended it in New Orleans, and I thought my yeah. apology was accepted. Yeah, and also because it came, you're like, I'm, you're apologizing even for something you didn't do. Well, that was the other, yeah. Which is a very, it takes a lot, because that's a hard thing to yeah. do. So, like, well, and you're yeah. like, don't you want to play in a wedding, girl? Why are you yelling at me? Yeah, literally. Like, <laughs> yeah. That's what it I like. should be her moment of yeah. happiness. Yeah. Celebrating. I just yeah. Celebrating. Well, I mean, if, if anything, yeah. the, the drama sort of evolved into her asking Sammy back, so, you know, it all but worked her, out for a reason. Yeah. She asked Sammy back before yeah. the engagement, <laughs> oh. but I don't think Sammy responded until after. Gotcha. That's what I heard. I but I don't know the dates, that's the thing, because it was like november is, mm. and that's when Vinny's birthday is, so she goes, she reached out in November, but I think before New Orleans, but then after New Orleans is when Sammy finally responded, so she was just like, hi. Okay, so she was it was a like a bot DMing, hi, hey, hi, yeah. hi, hi, hi. Came in hot, yeah. that's for sure. I feel like Sammy kind of comes in hot from what yeah. we see in oh, the yeah. trailer. Spicy margarita. <laughs> what can you say about the, the early discussions that she wanted to have with you guys? What was she looking forward to addressing? After you guys were like crying that she's back, she's like, by the way. Yeah. I know. Well, my jaw was still <laughs> unhinged oh, yeah. on the ground. So I You're was like, like, keep talking because I can't. Yeah, yeah, literally. I was like, I still don't think it's you. Like, is this AI? Is this no, yeah. a robot? We were still so yeah. surprised. And she was like getting into it. And we were like, so Girl. glad you're here. <laughs> we're just, we're very happy right yeah. now. It's funny, I feel like she probably came in because she joined so late with like 11 years of stuff going on in her head and you guys yeah. like, oh yeah, oh we're mo like we're just happy, yeah. happy, like hi. So happy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and yeah. I think it, I wasn't trying to have the smoke. No. No. <laughs> no. Like, I never want me. the smoke. No. I just want everyone Again, to be happy. Again, don't know how it's going to be edited. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. But well, you can hear we'll it from, it, from us first. <laughs> yeah. No smoke. No smoke. Yeah. Because yeah. she does say, I think the, the first episode, it's that she blocked you over the the shop's debacle. Oh, yeah, and you'll see that conversation. Okay. Yes, the competing boardwalk beach shop. Yeah, but I'm what? not I'm not the type of woman to compete against my friends opening other stores. So we just, we had a nice conversation about it. Okay. No one was copying anyone, and we're all allowed to open stores. Like, no one should be upset about that, you know? It's like little kid stuff. I think she owned it. No, she owned it. Okay. Yeah, okay, I mean, I got over it quick. Good, yeah, good, so you'll see it all go down. When well, you think about the evolution that you guys have made from the beginning of Jersey Shore to now, you have businesses, you're thriving, mm -hmm. your moms. What are what are you most proud of when it comes to all, all the achievements that you've had? Mommy, being mm -hmm. a mom. Being a mom, but being a badass mom and mm -hmm. taking my kids to places I never would have dreamed of growing up. Because where we grew up, it was so small town living that like, Oh, this yeah. couldn't even have been I never a dream left my of town. mine. Mm -hmm. So to like, be like, yeah, my nine and seven year old are here with me at work while I'm <laughs> filming with you guys, and we're still on TV 15 years later is insane. That's, yeah, yeah. and I nice can take experience. them with me, so. I love being mom. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. we can tell so much because it, like watching you guys interact with your kids is like, I think the best part of the show. Aww. Yeah, so Same, sweet. that's why I'm like, we need to show more of that, please. Yeah. Yes. Like, yeah. people have seen me fall down drunk off wine. Yeah. Like, let's, <laughs> let's show a little bit more, like me being mom. We, we do love seeing that, too, but I will say the kids yeah. are running around today, and they are so adorable, so well-behaved. Yeah, they're on the ride. Our yeah. minis, yeah. the so, girls. Our minis, Aww. yeah. So we'll let you guys get back to doing that, because we Thank have you. an unofficial shift at the shore store. Oh, my God, enjoy. <laughs> with uh, with Dina steal, and Angelina. You should steal something. Yes. Oh, oh okay. 
Oh, tell, if tell, Snooki said, said tell it. Danny Snooki said Snooki I could steal some booty oh. shorts. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, you think we'd look cute in those? Yeah. Totally. Okay. Yes. All right. <laughs> okay. Well, we're gonna go uh, snatch some booty shorts. Oh, I guess. Cheers to that. Right, cheers. Yeah, cheers, guys. Here, you chugged your drink. <laughs> I love you for I that. Okay. 